everyone, thanks for joining me for this video. Today we're going to use Essence Lash Lip Kit to do a perfect lash lid and brow lamination. This kit is suitable for the girls who want naturally curly lashes and fashion brow lamination. It contains all kinds of professional tools inside. So after you watch this video and you're interested in it, you can get one on Amazon and uh, try to do a lash lip and brow lamination at home by yourself. Before you use this kit, you should read our user's manual first. It has all kinds of languages with the precautions, so you should read it before you use it. And the use step is with pictures, so you can know the details vividly. And all you need to do is prepare some cotton swab first. The cotton swab and then get all the tools out. The tool kits. We have the long eyelashes brushes, two pieces, and the white brushes, three pieces, and three some, and has some lip brushes. So you get all the tools out and put it on the side, and then we can start to do the process. This glue ring is for. Uh, contain the lotions, the perm lotions and the facial lotions. All you need to do is prepare some cotton swab and then use the makeup remover to clean up the oily stuff on the lashes. Use the lip brushes to remove the liquid. Also, it can organize the lashes. Then use the eye patches to separate the lower and upper lashes. This is job, job type eye patches. So, it feels cool and also can separate the lotions in case you touch it on the skin then we choose a suitable side of silicon pads we have S, M, L so based on the length of your lashes if you have long lashes, you can choose the L side. If you have small lashes, you can choose the S side. Then we can use we use the glue to apply on the back side of the pads. We should not apply too much glue. And then wait a few seconds. With a few seconds, the glue in a half dry situation, it will be more sticky. You can pull up a little bit the, the eyelid and then make it fit on the loop of the lashes, like this. Make sure the pad is stick stick well and it will not move. Then use the glue to apply on the apply the glue on the front side of the pad. Normally I use it uh, I make it in separate step. The the, the front part, the middle part, and the tails. So I normally I brush the, the front first. A 
apply the glue in different in dif in different position is suitable uh, for, for who want so in case the glue dries so fast and then you need to you don't need to apply too much glue brush up the lashes as neatly as you can Then start to brush up the tails. During this time, we should make sure we organize well the lashes in neatly. Then we, we can perm the lashes in a very good effect. Then we started to apply the perm lotion, which we also call the step one. We had 10 pieces each on the kit. One piece is, one piece is uh, the sachet perm lotion can use for, can use to do a one time lash lip and one time brow lamination. So this kit, you can totally use it 10 times. We make it in such a package which is more clean and more hygienic and also the expired day can keep more longer. And squeeze the lotion on the glue rings. Don't squeeze too much because uh, just a little bit lotion is enough. Then we get a long stick eyelashes brushes in this part. The key to make a good lash lip is we just dip the lotion on the silicon pad parts, middle. Don't apply too much. Just the middle part, we apply the lotion on it. Don't brush it, just dip it. Dip. like this. Make sure the, the lotion is just deep on the middle part of the pads. Don't cover the tails, the, the lashes tails, or don't touch it on the loo of the lashes. This lotion should not touch your skin eyes, the skin of your eyes. Just the pads part, the middle part. If you have the uh, plastic field, you can get one, get a plastic view on your home, then you can cover it on the lashes. This can help the the perm lotion with uh, perming time will more faster, and the effects will be better. Remove the cotton, the plastic thing, and use the brush and cotton swab to remove the palm lotion. Same, you can pull up a little bit. 
the the upper eyelid and it can help you to remove the lotion more clean apply the step two the pump lotion the face lotion this part is very important so you need to make sure all the lashes stick on the pads same like the step one we just dip the fixed lotion on the middle part middle part of the lashes don't apply too much too much lotion on the lashes just dip it on the lashes the middle part don't apply the lotions to the loop of the lashes then same cover with a plastic film remove the plastic film same like the step one get the brush pull up a little bit the eyelid and remove the fixed lotion and use the makeup remover to clean off the glue on the silicon pads The glue is water-based, so it's very easy to clean it, clean it, and no resistant. After clearing well the the resistant lotion on the lashes, then we can use our nutrition oil with the olive oil essence which is can protect the lashes after pumping Now I'm going to show you how to do a perfect brown lamination. Use the glue. After you clean up the oily stuff on the on the brown's hair, then use the glue to apply it on the brown's hair. No need to apply too much glue. Then use the brown long stick brown hair brown brush to brush up all the brown hair in a neatly direction weight. You can brush the brown hair as neatly as you can and. and choose a shape brown shape that you like like this neatly then same the step one apply the step one 
squeeze the lotions on the glue ring use the brush Prime the perm lotion on the brown's hair. Make sure every brown's hair is covered with the perm lotion. Like this. And then also can cover with a plastic field and wait for um, five minutes. Five minutes for the normally healthy lashes, but if you have thin lashes, uh, thin brown hair, then you can choose the permanent time in three minutes. If you have corners brown hair, then you can extend the permanent time in six minutes. If you did the brown lamination at the very first time, we suggest you to control the time not longer than five minutes. After five minutes, then we remove the plastic film. Grab, grab up the perm perm lotion. When you grab up the perm lotion, you should keep the lashes. Also, as neatly, the brown hair as neatly in the same direction way. Then we apply the step two. Scrape the step two on the groom rings. Apply it on the brown hair. Don't apply too much lotion and then we cover it back the plastic film. Wait another five minutes. But if you have thin brown hair, then should be three minutes enough. If you have corners brown hair, then you can extend the permit time in six minutes. Did the very first time, we suggest no longer than five minutes. After five minutes, we remove the Plastic film and grab up the fixed fixation lotion. Get a clean cotton swab, use the remover to clean up the perm lotion and face lotion on the brown hair. Make sure no resistant, re resistant lotions on the brown hair.
So the brown lamination is finished. Then our Eastern Slush Lip Cape also adding the also adding the brown tinting tint coloring. It's black hair, a uh, black color, so also with this formula is very gentle. We get a clean glue ring. Squeeze the black tinting and then use the brush to apply the tinting on the brown hair. Before you do this, please make sure there's no resistance step one and step two lotion on the brown hair. You can apply the color links. Apply it on the the shades of your brows hair. When you do this thinning at home by yourself, you can totally you can apply the apply the shape carefully. After 20 minutes for brow tinting coloring, then we remove remove the black tint color. The the coloring time is about 15 to 20 minutes. But if you don't like too dark colors, so you can control the uh, control the coloring time in 15 minutes. But if you want dark color, then you can extend the, the coloring time in 20 minutes. Remove it, then we use the cleanser, the remover, to clean off the, the resistant tinting color. The dark color, bronze hair color, it makes you look more energetic. So a lot of people like black color. The best part of our brow, brow tinting coloring is it is no stimulated feeling and it only coloring the brown hair will not coloring the skin.
clean it well then we use the brush to seed it so the brown lamination and the brown tinting coloring is finished